This is just like a little impromptu vlog, I guess. Maybe a candid moment, even though it's more than a minute long. So, I don't know. Um, let me go and tell you, this video has no, no purpose at all. <laughs> None. I just wanted to say hey to my people who are still still members um still part of the membership i do have a really big video coming and don't mind me right now i'm taking my hair out this was the um purple rasta free paradise curl hair and that's out for public view now as i speak but um I am taking that out or whatever. But anyway, I do have a big video coming for memberships. Uh, it is the human hair with it um, and the different options you can do to have it crocheted in your head. I didn't take the class because, you know, you have to sign, I'm sure, disclosures and something like that. And I did not want to do that. So I kind of had to figure out how to do it. And I bounced some ideas off of some friends and um, came together with what I feel like. It, it may not be their method, but I'm definitely not gonna call it my method because I feel like this is what they do. Looking at, you know, the work that I've seen online, I feel like that's, this is kind of how they do it, you know, but I can't confirm and I can't deny. I don't know. Um, but anyway, I do have that video coming. I'm just indecisive um, if I want to use actual human bundle hair or just for demo purposes um do like a synthetic blend you know something like that so i'm not sure i have synthetic blend i already have like a bundle of that that i would use on a mannequin right but if i use human hair i'm putting it on my head <laughs> But it's fairly new to me. And what if I mess up, you know? So I don't know which I'm going to do. But that is definitely coming to membership. So definitely before the end of the year. And this is, what, mid-November. So it's coming. But um, for the rest of you, hey. <laughs> for the time being, hey. I, um... It's a funny story, I have, I don't know how many random vlogs that I started, right? And I never follow through with them because what people don't know is vlogs, that's some hard work. Like it's, it's really a lot of work to get it lined up and make sure like when you're out, you know, there's always a radio playing. So you gotta worry about copyright. You gotta worry about people in the shots and, and tag, you know, like tag license plates and, you know, concealing your location to make sure that you're safe. You know, all these different things that you have to do. And I just haven't been able to commit to doing all of that. Like it's, it's really hard work. I think I got one out and that was the one prepping to take you home, you know, before he passed. So yeah, that's, that's about it. But then I was like, maybe I should just take all of the videos that I started or random footage that I was like, oh, I'll put this in a vlog. Why don't I just put it all together and just make one video? And then, you know, doubt seeps in and they're like, nobody wants to see that. Like it's not put together. There's not a story. What is it saying? You know, all of this, this crap inside. So I, you know, I just let it just go, you know? And um, one of my favorite YouTube uh, content creators, she did it. I just watched her video, like literally just watched it while I was taking this half down. Um, she was like unorganized vlog or something like that. She said um, was the title and it was just random clips, you know, throughout the week. And I found it fascinating and it wasn't anything. It's not like she was, you know, 
going through the the Amazon or something, you know, like it was regular stuff. Going to get something to eat with coworkers, um, going to see Wakanda, going, uh, she was at work, you know, I mean, just different stuff and just vlogging about, you know, her feelings and how she felt that day or, you know, maybe her outfit that she had on, you know, whatever. And I really loved it. Like, I felt like I got to know her way more than I have in the two, three years that I've been watching her, at least two years. Um, and so I'm like, dang, I could have really done that. Why didn't I do that? You know, like, so this is me again saying no more deleting my videos. I am going to post them. Um, and hopefully y'all will watch them and hopefully you will like them. I don't think that I would still open up and put them for public view. I think that would be a membership only thing. But the thing is with my membership videos, like y'all are there and I can't believe y'all still here. Like I can't believe like some of y'all still here. Like I don't, I don't understand, but thank y'all. I love y'all. Um, but y'all don't watch them. Like some of you, I, a couple, like not even half though, not even half. Y'all don't watch them. I so I don't know. Like even the um the content, like you know hair content or something. Y'all ain't been watching. So I don't know. I don't know what's going on there. Um. So let me know. Let me know what y'all want to see, please, if you see this one. Let me know what y'all want to see. Because I truly wish that I knew or there was a way for me to differentiate between the people who are here for strictly hair, my methods that I come up with, you know, or try to figure out, um, you know, detailed classes or whatever let me know that if that's what you're here for because if you're giving your money for that then that's something that i want to strive to do that's not necessarily saying that you tell me today and i'm gonna have a video you know out tomorrow no but there's something in my head that i can focus on and say okay you know what i have a lot of members that are here because they want this let me focus on this you know i want to be able to do that but, um, you know, and then maybe there's some people that are here because maybe I just rock with me, you know, maybe you want to get to know who I am, um, you know, and if that's the case, then maybe do more vlogs and stuff. So, you know, I, I want to know that. I need to know that information. So, and it's not going to hurt my feelings either way. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you're like, hey, girl, you cool, but I really just want to know about the hair. Tell me that. Tell me that. Because I don't want to waste my time. I don't want to waste y'all time. You know, it takes a lot of time and effort to, you know, record the videos, edit them. And I don't want to put them out. And then I'll be something that you guys want to see. So, tell me. <laughs> Let me tell y'all, this is day one my cycle right and this is day one of me trying to diva cup if y'all have tried those can y'all let me know y'all's experience i was interested in them years ago like when they first came out but i chickened out i really chickened out um but they've kind of just been present in my mind still you know for years and years and years <laughs> so Uh, I'm trying it and we're gonna see what happens. Like literally, I haven't even tried to take it out yet. So, um, I guess I'll overshare that information when I do it and let y'all know for those of you who may be interested um, in getting one or trying one, I'll let you know. Oh, that's my hair up. So, let's be careful here, Shay. Um, so, oh yeah, so the one that I have is a new, a new kind, 
it's uh it has a pull tab on it and i thought that was really cool like you pull it and it breaks the suction of the cup and so that it's easier to pull out and so <laughs> i really hit myself because i don't even know if i got this shit in right now i don't know um i did check uh after about an hour of wearing it to see if I was leaking or spotting at all and I didn't see anything so right now I think it's okay I don't I won't say that I feel nothing like sitting right here I don't feel anything um and when I just got up a few minutes ago I didn't um necessarily nothing like flagged me like Ooh. oh yeah a deeper cup you know it was nothing like that um but like when I first put it in, I can just say I was keenly aware that it was there, you know? And so I wasn't sure if I had it in right or not. But if like you shift or, you know, wind your hips a certain way, you can kind of, kind of feel it. But it doesn't hurt, it's just there, you know? So I don't know. I don't know if I have it in right or not. <clears throat> but I guess we'll see. Um. Oh, I went to see Wakanda yesterday, the second one. It was so good. It was so good. Now, I almost cried my eyes out um, during the first part <laughs> for the funeral, you know. Glad we was able to attend, um, but they almost, they almost took me out. But it was really good, though. It was really, really good. And I know that there's going to probably be a second and a third and a fourth and a fifth. And I'm looking forward to seeing all of them. Wait, yeah, it was really good. What else did I do yesterday? Mm, I went and ate it out back. I didn't take no pictures. Ooh, but I got leftovers. I, got, I, I had the rib and the steak. And we had um the blooming, blooming shrimp something i don't know it was good though it was salty but it was good and um some kind of dip as well with nachos that came in a little skillet that was really good that was really really good <clears throat> but yeah not too much going on here i do have um two options right now to put in but um i got one um is this um yankee twist um the girl from crochet braid plus she wanted me to do a video for like an ad uh for her and um the hair is gorgeous i can't wait to put that in i really can't um, even though you know, I only record on the weekends and I wasn't prepared for it. If I if I receive a hair like on a Wednesday, Thursday or something, then I know I can take my hair out Thursday, Friday, you know, wash it, have it prepped, braid it so that Saturday or Sunday I can record. Um, but however, I received this hair on Saturday. So, well, I actually got it Sunday morning, but I'm assuming because it was so early when I seen it, it was probably Saturday. Um... But anyway, so that means I'm actually scheduled to record it next weekend, right? But I want it. I want it so bad. And then on the other hand, I do have um, another company that um, I have a half with. And it looks so pretty. Um, it's just that with the half wigs, I don't want to have to do my hair every day. And I, I know I'm going to have to do that, you know? Um, so I don't know. I don't know. So I don't know if I'm going to end up recording that or doing a Yankee twist. I don't know, girl. Probably just a half wig because I'm, again, this is day one of my period and I don't think I have the motivation and the enthusiasm that I would need to record an advertisement for someone, you know? And I want to make sure that I'm cheerful. I'm super excited about it, though. I've been um, 
downloading different musics, you know, whatever for the background. Um, debating, you know, in my head, like putting together, you know, like what shirt I'm gonna wear, cause I mean, it's from here up, so, you know. But yeah, I think I'm going to, probably going to take this hair um, down, put my makeup on, and then record the video for the half week probably i feel like i probably should because that would give my hairline and really my hair a chance to breathe which was part of my i guess you call it resolution whatever uh this year you know to take better care of my hair and which i have upheld to that it's just that i need to get my ends clipped and i haven't gotten a good pair of scissors to do that recently I always like to get a new pair every time I clip my ends and I keep forgetting. Actually, I've got some from the beauty supply store and I lost them. Like I didn't get a chance to use them. I found them once while I was cleaning. I, I put them somewhere I would remember and now they're gone again. I don't know. So, who knows? And then also today, I really want to redo my altar. I really want to um, add some pictures and stuff. Um, and I don't know, like add some different elements or whatever to it. So yeah, it's probably gonna be the half week because that's gonna be the quickest thing for me to do. I'll see y'all guys when I see you. What's up, y'all? So, damn, I hope y'all can hear me. Anyway, I am on my way to get me some molds, give me a little lunch to eat. Um, I'm thinking I'm gonna go ahead and post this vlog because. I don't know. I don't know if I got enough. I gotta go back and see if I got enough. But um, the video that I had planned on dropping, I needed the link, you know, to post in the description box. And the person who sends the links apparently is on vacation. So yeah, I can't post that video. So now I gotta find something. So I either gotta take something off of memberships and post it today or i'm just hurry up and throw this all together because i i don't think i'm gonna like edit nothing out you know it's a vlog or whatever just like a little what what my, my one of my favorite um youtubers like i said she was um saying like you know she just put unorganized vlogs together or whatever and so i'm really not gonna edit nothing out of this i can just put it together real quick and put it out um instead of you know putting it out later but man speaking of favorite youtuber let me tell y'all so i feel a type of way right like for me i'm an everyday person right like i'm not rich i don't you know try to flex or something for the gram like i am you know i got my highs my lows my ups my downs um just like the majority of people you know and one thing about me when i first started my channel i was very very um i was very self-conscious like about what i exposed you know because you know you see things on youtube you see creators on youtube and there was even this girl that came out with a video about um content creators or black content creators being um 
not being relatable anymore, you know? And I I really felt that video um, that was put out, like I said, I don't know, earlier this year, because it seems like, which I'm glad, I'm so happy that people are able to come up, you know, and, and you know, do better for themselves or whatever. But it's like, like for instance, I wanted to do cleaning videos, right? But I have a regular Alabama house, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not in no mansion. I mean, I'm in a, a nice house, you know, a nice four bedroom house, but you know, it's not, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's just an Alabama house, you know, but all the cleaning videos that I see, all these women are lavish and these are, you know, or luxury apartments or, you know, 16 bedroom mansions, you know, and I'm like, that's not what I want to watch. I want to watch regular ass people cleaning the house, you know, and so that's what I was thinking that I wanted to do, but I was so self-conscious. I taught myself out of doing it. So, okay, one of my favorite content creators, she was talking about her own struggles. The reason why I really love her is because she was always transparent. She was the one that mot like motivated me just in watching her videos to be more transparent and, you know, just feeling like it's okay to just be me, you know? So, anyway, she was doing her thing, you know? She was um, doing a video. She was talking about her personal you know, experience and struggles and what she had going on. And it was some helpers that going to like go up on her comments talking shit about her business. And it was just crazy to me, like how disrespectful it was and like how they're trying to shame her for just living her life. Like that shit really, really, really sent me. Like I really feel a type of way about that. And like, I don't, I guess it bothers me so much because there's not a lot of content creators out here that's doing that. That's not trying to stunt for the gram. You know what I'm saying? Like, there's just regular people that's letting everybody else know that it's okay to be regular people and have regular problems, you know? And I don't want people like that to come for her and make her shut down because she encourages me. Hell. I don't know. Anyway. I had to get off my chest because it really kind of pissed me off. Like, really, really. Like, really, really. Where am I shit at? I got to um, transfer money because I'm in the middle of switching banks because my bank is tripping. Talking about a new security procedure they got and where well, you got to call and shit before you can swipe your card places or something. I don't know. I ain't never heard no mess like that. So, I went to my secondary bank, which I didn't know what a debit card was, so I had to get an to order one. It was yesterday, so I ain't got it yet. And so now I'm living off of you know, these other little rinkin' ink cards. So, why I got that much money in now? Hmm. Yeah, okay. I got some money in that one. Okay, okay, okay. I have a little bit, I have a little bit. Okay, let's go to mouse.
Uh, white chicken. Yeah. Uh, yeah, the peppers and uh, queso. Yeah. Um, cheese, pico, yeah, lettuce. Damn, that's something they should have started with. Mm. I'm so sorry. I don't want it. Uh, uh. No, girl, they out of lettuce. How do you be out of the most basic thing? <laughs> I can't though. I could have went to, to Chipotle. They could have really started with it. You know what I'm saying? Like they could have. They could have really just started with it. Cause we've been wasting my time at this point. Like this is a big, big shopping center and it'd be crazy around the holidays. So I was really trying to stay like in the front of it so I could easily get out. But seems like I finna had to go deep off in here to get me some food worth something, I guess. But lettuce is that's the best part for me. I already felt the type of way when they took away the uh, other kind of lettuce. Not all they got is an iceberg, and that's just something I'm selling for. But shit, you ain't even got that. You ain't even got that. Mm -mm. No, 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 no. And then Chipotle, I like to go right at eleven. You know because. Like right when they open because they always out of their veggies. They be pissing me out. tree for real when I'm over here. But I 
know that line long. I know it is. You know what I'm saying? I'm not go back to work. I'm already pushing it being over here in this area. I'm a runner. I'll be I do want queso on the side for my chips. Okay. You never know about this Alabama, man. This Alabama weather is bipolar. I had the heater on full blast in the morning. Now I got to turn the air on full blast. Full hot. Okay. Mm. Oh, that's water down. I guess I'm gonna have to make it public because I wasn't gonna make it public. They wanna give me that now for Do I have any? Greedy. Look. I'm gonna Lord said, be ye ready. show y'all this food and then I'm gonna watch handmade and I got my um
vinaigrette. And this is gonna happen for me. This is gonna happen. I usually get the, uh, what's it called? Sophrius or something? It's like an imitation meat, and it's pretty good, but I don't like it with the vinaigrette, and I really wanted the vinaigrette, so I got chicken instead. Mm-mm-mm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this gonna get ugly. All right. I'll either be back or just the end of the vlog. <laughs>